All righty, so as we know, we've got the uh, calling. Uh, well, very luckily. Um, hope the rest of the world gets there soon. But uh, the calling will be a great spectacle at the end of the month up in Auckland, New Zealand, Carb Merchant. And day one, it's not the official calling, but it's a PTI, so a professional tournament invite. So the winner will get that, which can get you into worlds, etc. Um, the first prize will be a gold skull cap and top eight get cold foil iras, which is pretty sought after anyway, but of course a top deck and blitz. So it's gonna be a big day. And the format, as you also may know, is Arcane Rising Sealed, which I believe LSS are very uh, excited about. They put a lot of work into the limited um, play, uh, you know, and thoughts with limited in general, draft sealed for Arcane Rising. So I thought um, do a video for a sealed pool and just have a look see what it looks like and uh, share some thoughts along the way so let's open some packs so remember uh, at an armory or whatnot you're probably a bit more relaxed but if you are playing a bigger tournament um, you do want to try and do this fairly quickly to start so the general advice is just put your equipments and tokens up one place put all your uh, generics here and then your classes in, um, in piles as well just to sort of start off and see what you got so we got four classes there of course arcane rising um, ranger mechanologist rune blade wizard um, yep. and token you can play any hero obviously they're just uh, their tokens probably be playing a young dash of course in sealed um, the equipments you have to play the ones you open uh, and the weapons are tokens as well so if I play dash and I need the pistol I can just acquire one that's fine or oh, double ranger rares some strong arrows here Voltic and stir is pretty good and a young cane. Rebel, rifting, or oh, dash boots. Plunder runs are pretty strong. Spell blades, good. More red arrows. You can see three packs in, uh, it's a pretty even split across classes, and I believe you'll find that 99% of the time. Uh, the variance might be like one class has 15 and one has 12, um, so it's not huge. Uh, of course, Arcane Barrier is really important um, to find in Limited, um, in case your opponent's playing the Wizard or the Rune Blade, you'll want to have some defense against that and got a viscerai I've heard this format's faster than Welcome to Wraith and I believe that's true from the few games I've had one big thing that you'll notice is apart from legendaries all of the equipments the generics and class equipments in Arcane Rising have zero defense I guess to sort of balance out the Arcane prevention side so you can't really block you know 95% of decks are not blocking any damage with their equipment which does pretty much probably just speed it up a turn on average um, so yes just a interesting side note there one last pack Now, by no means am I a master of limited. I'm kind of uh, opening these up, you know, with you if you like. So, <laughs> please leave in the comments if uh, what you would have chosen to play and why. Uh, and in return, that'll help me learn, I'm sure, as well. Um, but I'd have to say, now that we got all the packs out, one thing that I 
think is somewhat true um, is it's a bit easier to automatically go to room blade or to ranger um, the reason is like you know the strongest card in wizard seems to be the storm striders and if you don't open storm striders then that's not great and also here we've got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve wizard cards we need a 30 card deck so that's less than half and only two of them are like red for big damage so already using like Kano's ability, etc., um, it's just not it's not very huge. You do have some opt, um, and you could play attacks and things, but yeah, it's probably quite a different game style. Um, perhaps if you played your generics and maybe some attacks, um, you're throwing out attacks, pitching these to the bottom, and late game if you had five red spells, uh, you know you could do some Kanoing and sort of blow them out um, on the the later turns but again it's a quick format so wizard seems a bit harder it's something you might want to focus on and, and see if it's something that's crackable um, and here like mechanologist I mean there's not a single red in all of these cards like in this pool um, so that's not strong you know like straight off the bat but the other thing is again um, with her main ability of boost um, if we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, half of our deck can hit boost. And if we don't hit boost, our turn's over. Um, again, there is opt. So cards like Force Sight um, are going to opt if you play it out of Arsenal. Um, so that's decent, but there's only a couple. Um, Rabble could help you see what's on top if you want to boost. Um, so there's two of those, or three of those. So you've got like five cards that help with Mechanologist. You've got this. So again, uh, similar to Wizard, my thoughts for that would just be in a very general sense. You know, perhaps you play it safer at the start, you block a bit more, and you try and condense your deck to your all Mechanologist cards and a few Opt cards. And then you know that you can have two or three turns of just boosting out and doing like 8 to 10, 12 damage. Um, but yeah, it feels a little bit, uh, a little bit limited again um, there. So, I mean, in these two pools, um, those two classes look pretty tough. Um, now... You may not agree, of course, but uh, with all that said, um, why are the other two classes, Rune Blade and Ranger, a bit easier? Well, Ranger's got the downside of fatiguing if she goes too hardcore. Um, but one very good card to look for is Salvage Shot. And here we actually have two red, and we have a blue, which could get pumped as well. So these are basically the drones of the format, and if you can uh, dominate them with her ability, then that's very likely they go into the bottom. So that if you get, you know, one, two, three salvage shots, um, and you can see yourself hitting with those, that's going to give you a bit longer game. And to be honest, like all her cards, unlike Bravo, if they hit at all, they do their effect. So she's quite taxing, and with less, you know, not many defense reacts in Arcane Rising. Um, you're going to get some dominatings and hits through a fair bit more. And the other thing is they're just arrows. Your death dealer can get them into arsenal. And then a lot of the generics will offer pump. Um, or just, you know, again, cards like Rabble seem very good in Azalea. Uh, you play it, you look at the top. Oh, it's an arrow. I'll dominate it in with their ability. Uh, yeah, I've just hit for two or three go again. And then I'm hitting with this dominated arrow. So it's information plus an extra attack. Um, and then you have cards like Come to Fight to pump, say, your blue salvage shot. So it's hitting for six. It blocks for three, which helps a lot as well. Um, and yeah, you've got Opt, of course, in general, Fervence, and uh, where's the other one? Foresight seems very good in Ranger. It does both things you want. It pumps your arrow, and it opts to see about Dominate. So... Yeah, I think this is fairly fairly good for that. Um, so yeah, it's, it seems a bit more general 
uh, something like Ranger, it's not so sort of specific or having to have the right cards. And then with Runeblade, kind of similar. So, you know, he's just, he's got Nebula Blade as backup, which is great. That probably gives him a much longer game overall than something like Ranger. Um, we've only got one red here, but it's a bit more grindy. Um, and yeah, you can block some damage, make some rune chance. Um, you, it's probably better to get a few more. I mean, we've got one reduce. You'd probably like to see, um, you know, maybe some read the runes, which we actually have none here. Um, but yeah, Viscera is kind of quite a good go-to um, because he also is fine with your generics. So if you had something like uh, read the runes, the Cadaverous Contraband, hit them with it, put it back on, block out for a turn, make some more rune chance with read the rune if you had it. And uh, yeah, it can be a lot more grindy. Um, so that is an overall spiel about it. But if we just put wizard over here and we put away these zero red dash, um, I guess the last thing to look at would just be your equipment. So we did get the Achilles accelerator, which is okay. Um, I think one big thing that changes dash, you know, aside from boost, if you open induction chamber, um, it's probably very considerable to play it because it's it's got to be good. You're just going to pistol twice a turn at least as, as a minimum. Um, but yeah, I mean, this this card here, um, probably not massive for, say, Ranger, um, but we've got some now rune. It's probably quite good for Viscerai, but again, we didn't really get the... Um, read the runes, which is a bit of a shame. So yeah, um, if we just, to do something for you here, um, have a look at this. And to be honest, like a lot of people know I've uh, been a big Azalea fan. I did play her for about two or three months when Arcane Rising came out. Uh, it was quite COVID-y times, but uh, we were playing a lot TTS online. And I played a lot of leagues with Azalea, um, pulled out some wins, but she's quite difficult and constructed and still blitz. Oh, I, you know, I've played a few games in blitz, but if limited's her place to shine, then let's go for it. <laughs> but yeah, we've got the double red salvage, which is of course very good. We've got two red hamstrings, which is very good. We've got a headshot, which is gonna hopefully hit for six. Take Aim is a very good card. We've got two of those, they're rares. Um, yellow head shot, searing shots are great. We've got a go again arrow here. We might play this card. Um, yeah, arrow's obviously good. And of course a reload defense reaction. They're very at a premium, so we'll probably play those. Uh, Fate for Scene, um, we're gonna play. It's a defense reaction again, and it opts, so it can set up a dominate for next turn. Um, Something like Plunder Run is going to be very good. Um, potentially Life for Life, but it is blue, so maybe not. Who knows? The Rebels are good, but we're getting pretty blue heavy here, which is a bit of a shame. Um, all our good cards are in blue. <laughs> um, but Rebels just like a, a chip, chip card. <coughs> Bigger Rush is very good. Um, very good card to look out for if you're playing like pumps or, you know, take aim, come to fight, foresight. This is just going to be a go again attack, which is awesome. You can get free uh, action points off this if you Azalea it in, um, which is nice. Maybe you just play some life gain and Sunkiss makes it more playable, like makes this more relevant, um, which is cool. And maybe these forerunners with opt. Um, something like a hmm. you play these. 
1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, 101, 102, 103, 104, 105, 106, 107, 108, 109, 110, 111, 112, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, 101, 102, 103, 104, 105, 106, 107, 108, 109, 110, 111, 112, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, 101, 102, 103, 104, 105, 106, 107, 108, 109, 110, 111, 112, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, 101, 102, 103, 104, 105, 106, 107, 108, 109, 110, 111, 112, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, 101, 102, 103, 104, 105, 106, 107, 108, 109, 110, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, 101, 102, 103, 104, 105, 106, 107, 108, 109, 110, 111